Om Shanti. Welcome to second of December's Godly Blessing. We generally think that if we leave a body, all of us, no matter which religion do we belong to, which country, which place, which ethnicity, we are all going to heaven. Now, is that a myth or is that a reality? And is it so easy to go to heaven that when you compare it with getting a visa for United States or any other country, let's say Australia, it's become so difficult to get up here and to get a visa that to go to, comparatively to go to heaven is just one thing. You just need to leave your body or let's say physically die and you as a spirit then goes to heaven without any checks, without any concerns, without anything to do. So God here says and explains us very clearly in a couple of examples and a couple of hints. He says, may you become crowned with the crown of the kingdom of the world. So God's kingdom on earth is heaven on earth, on earth, not anywhere else. By being crowned here with the crown of responsibility for world transformation through self-transformation. It's very clear and simple. God says, just as you all consider yourselves to have a right over the father, that means he is my father, so I have the right to enter the gates of heaven and over your attainments, that is heaven, and also on the Father, in the same way, be crowned with the responsibility of self-transformation and world transformation. Crown means responsibility of world transformation through self-transformation, that unless or un until or unless we transform ourselves, we are not ready to enter the gates of heaven. You will then have a right, you will then have a right to be crowned with the crown of the kingdom of the world. So once we take responsibility over here to help the creator change the world by us changing. He's not going to just snap and the whole world becomes heaven. He says you have to become capable to even enter the gates of heaven. The present is the basis of the future. Whatsoever we do right now. Check yourself by looking into the mirror of knowledge as to whether you have in your Brahmin life, the double crown of purity, the study and service. Purity, study and service. The double crown of purity, that is the halo of purity. That means our thoughts are so pure that our aura is pure enough. The study, that means are we becoming soul conscious and service, that means are we helping other souls to become soul conscious and become capable enough to enter the gates of heaven on earth. If any crown is incomplete here, you will claim a right to a small crown there. That means if we are less soul conscious or we have less purity or we are not serving humanity so much through godly knowledge, then obviously the crown will be smaller. That means we will be a smaller king over there. So kingdom of heaven means they have to be kings and queens over there. Now who can become a king and queen in that world? is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris on a daily basis. You two are most welcome to learn this. Om Shanti with this.